we discover that matter is made of atoms. And then we very quickly discover after that that the atom is electrons. Initially, we have this almost solar system-like model that it's a nucleus, a dense nucleus with an electron going around it. And then we discover the nucleus is made of protons and neutrons. That's 1930s, by the oh, way. By the way, that discovery orbit the model is still the, the symbol for an atom. Yeah. You know, the, yeah, the atomic we, we kept it just because so, so, it's yeah. classic, you know, but that's, atoms look nothing like that. No, no, no. Right. And so then quantum mechanics comes in, tells you you can't have that because charged particles moving around in the vicinity of other charged particles radiate energy away and they wouldn't be stable. And mm -hmm. that was known, of course. Um, and so then you find that the nucleus is made of protons and neutrons. And as I said, the neutron, it's a 1930s discovery. So we're not that long ago. When uh, I'm amazed it. when so much, you know, we're now in the centennial decade of the discovery of quantum physics back in the 1920s. And the whole 1920s was done before we discovered the neutron. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, it's, it's, it's almost living, it is living memory for some people yeah. just about this. <laughs>